okay let us see today the topic that is the lines of regression and coefficient of correlation the question is uh, here with us that is a two lines of regression are given to us that is 8x minus 10y plus 66 equals to 0 and the second one 40x minus 18y equals to 214 with the more, some more information that is sigma x square equals to 9 then you have to find out the mean values of x and y that is we have to find out what x bar and y bar that is the mean values then we have to find out the coefficient of correlation between x and y that is small r that we have to find out and standard deviation of y standard deviation is of y denoted by the sigma y then the variance of y that is we have to find out sigma y square this four quantities we have to find out the lines of regressions are given to you this is the example we have data tha diya hua. वहाँ से फिर हम coefficient of correlation निकालते थे और lines of regression lines of regression दो रहते हैं lines of regression y on x और एक रहता है x on y अब यहाँ पे दो lines दी हैं so that you have to decide now which line you have to take as a y on x और दूसरा x on y so generally हम पहला line लेते हैं it is regression line y on x उसे हम कैसे करते हैं second वाला x on y okay so I consider the equation number uh, writing this equation the given equation as in the standard form हम क्या करते हैं जो constant है उसको r जस में लेते हैं so that will be minus 60 6 so it will be the 8x minus 10y equals to minus 66 और second equation आपका already standard form में है उसको as it is लिखेंगे अब यहां से हम y on x निकाल रहे हैं regression line y on x so 8x का जो term है उसको हम right में ले लेंगे so I have the equation as it is 8x minus uh, okay sorry यहां uh, first of all uh, we have to find out here mean values of x and y so that we will find out here better way उसके बाद फिर हम निकालते हैं that is coefficient of correlation so we know that one more thing that is we have to just remember that is lines of regression always passes through the mean values of it is x and y so that is x bar and y bar से अगर वो pass होते हैं मतलब वो इस equation को satisfy करेंगे so therefore I replace this x and y by it is x bar and y bar उससे मैंने replace कर दिया यहाँ पे so I have this two equation and this two equation can be easily solved simultaneously to get the values of x bar and y bar हम निकाल सकते हैं उसको तो x bar आ जाएगा 13 y bar equals to this 17 that is mean values of x and mean value of y now after that we have to find out that coefficient of correlation for that what we do here I am writing the one line which we are having as a regression line y on x तो मैंने equation number one लिया यहाँ पे one को मैंने minus ten y left पे रखा हूँ और x का part right में लिया हमने minus eight minus eight x minus sixty six now minus ten से आपने divide किया इसको so I got here as y equals to point eight x plus six point six so this is the regression line y on x we have got similarly second equation लेते हैं x को express करते हैं in terms of y तो उसमें हम क्या करेंगे forty x लिया it is eighteen y plus two fourteen and then dividing by the 40 we get x equals to 0.4 y plus 5.35 so what we do we are expressing the x in terms of y here and here we are expressing the y in terms of x now after that comparing this quantity with the standard form the standard form kya hota hai mara agar y on x hai toh y equals to a1 x plus a0 if you compare a1 is 0.8 vaise same yaha pe agar hum compare karenge we have expressed x in terms of y Standard form से हमने convert किया, sorry compare किया, so x equals to b1 y plus it is b0. So compare करेंगे तो you get that is value of b1 as it is 0.45. Okay? उसके बाद coefficient of correlation is having the formula r equals to is under root of a1 b1. So just put the value of a1 b1 take under root, we get the coefficient of correlation between that two variable x and y. Okay? So this is the way of calculating the coefficient of correlation. And one more thing, अगर ये value आपका r का वैल्यू लाइन नहीं करता है -1 और +1 के बीच में दैट मींस आपने जो रिग्रेशन लाइन चूज किया हुआ है वो गलत है आपको फिर रिग्रेशन लाइन इंटरचेंज करना पड़ेगा मतलब जो आपने पहले y x लिया था उसको आपको x एंड y लेना पड़ेगा और जो आपने x एंड y लिया था रिग्रेशन लाइन उसको आपको y x लेना पड़ेगा ठीक है दैट चेंज यू हैव टू मेक देन इफ r डज नॉट लाइज बिटवीन -1 टू +1 अगर लाइ करता है देन दिस इज करेक्ट ओके व्हाटएवर वी हैव टेकन now after that it is asked to you find out it is coefficient of correlation sorry standard deviation of y so for that we are having a regression coefficient y on x the formula is a1 r sigma y by sigma x we know the value of a1 already calculated then we know the r it is 0.6 sigma y sigma x we know it is what 3 
so just sigma y we have to find out here sigma y equals to then 3 goes here 0 0.6 goes here just calculate we get it is value as 4 so which is nothing but the standard deviation of y we have to find out the variance of y so just take a square of the standard deviation we will get the variance sigma y square equals to it is 16 okay so this is the way of solving the example on it is coefficient of correlation and lines of regression uh, if they are given okay thank you